Many successful entrepreneurs utilize income-producing assets to ensure multiple steady streams of revenue. By maintaining a diverse portfolio of income-generating assets, investors can ensure they are generating consistent money over time. In this video, I will share with you 13 assets that are making people rich right now. 1. Bonds Bonds are a type of fixed income investment. They are loans made to large organizations such as national governments, cities and corporations. The borrowing organization promises to pay the bond back on an agreed-upon date. Until then, the borrower makes agreed-upon interest payments to the bondholder. People who own bonds are also called creditors or debt holders. The first way to earn from bonds is to hold those bonds until the maturity date and collect interest payments. Interest is usually paid twice a year. The second method is to sell them at a higher price. 2. Stock The stock of a corporation is all of the shares into which ownership of the corporation is divided. A single share of the stock represents the corporation's fractional ownership in proportion to the total number of shares. The reality is that investing in the stock market carries risk, but it is one of the most efficient ways to build up one's net worth when approached in a disciplined manner. People who buy stocks are called shareholders, and they have voting rights of the company as well as residual income. People earn from the stock market either through buying and selling shares or getting residual profits called dividends throughout the year. Also, in the case of liquidation, the investor receives a percentage of assets. More than ever, people are searching for companies with prospects to purchase shares. 3. Index Mutual Funds Unlike stocks, which only allows you to purchase shares from a company one by one, mutual funds pulls money from a collection of investors and invest it in a variety of securities, like stocks and bonds. So, you're buying into the entire basket of companies as a whole. Investment in a mutual fund is a safe type of investment to make because it allows you to have a diversified portfolio. There are various types of mutual funds, but statistically, index funds are the best kind. For example, the S&P 500, an index fund strategy, brings together the best 500 performing companies, and when a company falls off, the top 500 gets replaced with a new great performing one. 4. Patents and Trademarks This basically is for inventors. It is a form of protection given to new inventions. It is a document that certifies that you own a particular device and also describes what your design does. When your work is patented, companies who want to use your innovation are meant to pay for it. Patents are a powerful and valuable asset because a single license can make you incredibly wealthy. Also, just as a patent is issued to protect inventions, trademarks are used for symbols, words and phrases. If your mark is licensed and marketable, people will pay you to use it for commercial purposes. Beyonce trademarked the name of her daughter Blue Ivy Carter before she was born to make sure nobody uses it commercially. Trademarks can either be local or commercial. 5. Gold and Precious Materials Investing in gold and other precious metals such as platinum and titanium are one way that individuals, especially the wealthy, accumulate more wealth for themselves. Gold maintains considerable value even when paper currency is weak. Also, titanium and platinum, for example, are used in the construction of many electronics which makes them prized by businesses and governments all over the world. 6. Real Estate Investment Trust Rates This is the most popular type of investment that many people are getting in. A real estate investment trust is like the mutual trust of real estate. They are a collection of properties operated by a company that uses money from investors to buy and develop real estate. If you want to invest in real estate without purchasing or financing a property, then Real Estate Investment Trust is the best decision for you. Rates also focus on a variety of industries, both domestic and international, and pay out dividends. 7. Certificate of Deposits A Certificate of Deposit, or CD, is a low-risk financial investment offered by banks. How this scheme works is that you loan money to the bank for a certain period, usually called term lent, and gain interest on the principal during that period. The benefits you get varies on how long you are willing to invest your money in the bank. The longer you loan the bank, the higher the interest you get. 
The only rule is that you do not get access to the money until the duration of investment is completed. 8. Property Rentals Property rentals means acquiring a property, like a car or a house, and hiring it out to people for a nominal fee. Although properties are profitable assets, the risk is enormous. In the sense that, for instance, if you own a house, you are responsible for all facets of the building you are renting out. You will have to do repairs and maintenance from time to time. And if there is a tenant who refuses to pay rent, you will have to undergo the stress of chasing him out. 9. Brand In the world today, branding and online presence have become assets that many people invest in. Many companies, businesses and even families spend so much money on branding, not only because they want the public to be aware of their products, but also because they want their brand to be a tool for them to generate more money. Do you know that if a Disney or Apple logo is placed in a regular plain polo, its selling price may be three times of its original price? That's the power of a growing brand. 10. Traditional Business Building a conventional business is not an easy task, but it is one asset that if time, energy and money are adequately invested on, does not only yield returns but still functions even after the demise of its owner. Traditional businesses may range from car wash, bars, coffee shops, etc. Apart from the significant upfront costs and need for a store location, what you choose to do is mostly dependent on if you want to work full-time for yourself or make extra income on the side. 11. Digital Products Creating your products is low-cost and easily scalable. Ebooks, webinars, online courses, podcasts and even websites are all digital products that cost just your time, data and little cash to produce. Yet, they can serve as income-generating assets for an extended period. Although there is a lot of potential work upfront to build an audience, once you create that audience, it can be a high-income-producing asset. Many of the products that are created online can become relatively passive, which means that at a certain point, there is not much upkeep needed to continue a flow of income for you. 12. Cryptocurrency As the world turns digital, digital currencies are making waves. Research provided by Digital Assets Data shows how 2019's performance of the top 10 cryptocurrencies by market capitalization fared against other major asset classes, such as gold, oil, and equities. These days, people use these digital currencies to pay for goods and services. Cryptocurrency, especially Bitcoin and Ether, have made so many impressions that individuals go as far as selling their other properties to purchase Bitcoins. Companies and enterprises are looking towards investing in cryptocurrency. 13. Rare Coins and Artworks According to CNN, the super-wealthy individuals spend at least $1.1 million on luxuries every year. However, the luxuries they may buy may include rare U.S. coins, which many use as a wealth preservation tool. Rare coins are considered investments because of the significant historical value they hold and the fact that they are limited in supply. Hence, the investor who has some of these coins has the power to benefit significantly from them. Closely related to rare coins are fine art. Investors who acquire artworks do not only do that because of their beauty, but because they understand their worth. Fine art is one asset that people do not bargain to buy. Apart from reselling artwork, when gathered, some individuals use them to open private galleries or even lease their artwork to famous galleries. That way, you still own your artwork and it is generating passive income for you. The best thing about income-generating assets is that they aren't exclusive to experienced investors. With the right research and planning, anyone can get started investing today.